Welcome to an episode of the Dragon Capture Jar where I take a random dragon monster and talk about off the cuff. And it is week two of Golden Dragon Month. It's December. So many year end celebrations going on. So yes, we we need to celebrate. So these are dragons that technically I have talked about before, but now I have the maximum gold version. So they're 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 just fun cards in general. I just love them. So this week on week two, we have the fantastical dragon phantasme maximum gold look at that now gee i think it's been two years so it's great yeah so week two is a card that i talked about two years ago and my goodness has it been that long since i've been doing this dragon capture jars <laughs> it's amazing and this guy has alt art as well so i remember when fantastical dragon phantasme first came out it was so expensive and it was in the height of master rule four because generally this guy can special summon itself to the field and depending on how many link monsters your opponent controls you draw that many cards and i believe you shuffle one of them into the deck there so this is you know i should probably write, you know, write the card just to confirm that but no no i mean this is this was just an extremely powerful card at the time it came out and now it's been reprinted, and now that we're Master Rule 5, it's not, I mean, it's still a good card. It's just not that prevalent now. I mean, because links, well, link monsters are just not, you know, while they are important, that's not really the focus anymore. Unless you're playing Dragon Link. Always play Dragon Link. <laughs> that still has a decent number of link monsters in it. But no, I mean, we can spam the board now with, with fusion monsters, especially fusion monsters. Uh, synchros, Xyz, it just depends on the kind of deck that you're focusing around. You can spam the board with just about anything. But man, this was the real deal. Now, I do have the original. Um, I have three copies of the first edition secret, first printing of it. Um, they weren't cheap at the time, but um, basically I got them from Salted Neos, you know, like we were happy to buy it off of him because he didn't really need them. So, Fantastical Dragon Phantasme. Now, do any of you still play him? You know, is he, uh, is he in your main deck? Is he in your side deck? Let me know in the comments below and stay tuned for week three of Golden Dragon Month. And remember to be a good sport to play the game, not the fame.